بسم الله والصلاة والسلام على نبينا محمد وعلى آله وصحبه وسلم أما بعد هبت في الله it was reported that Ibn Sirin رحمه الله تعالى said many people are given to sinning and yet many of them are prone to remembering the sins of other people instead أهبت في الله this أثر exhibits the profound knowledge of the Salaf of this Ummah. The Salaf of the Ummah of Muhammad Sallallahu Alaihi Wasallam, the Salaf of Salih, Ridwan Allahi Alayhim, wa rahmatullah. And this beautiful Athar of Ibn Sirin shows us and lets us or should give us and encourage us to contemplate our own status, our own status with Allah How are you with your Lord? Or are you busy refuting the next man and your sister in Islam? Are you focusing all of your time thinking about others, their sins, others' mistakes, others' aqidah, but you haven't given any time or precedence to your own ibadah, your own worship of Allah subhanahu wa ta'ala in attending the Fajr prayer and in joining the good and forbidding the evil and serving your parents and having ta'awun ala bitr wa taqwa and all the other affairs of the religion and especially those affairs that have to do with yourself and your relationship with your Lord because they take precedence over you refuting someone who you think is from Ahl Bidah, or you think is a Zendik, or you think is a Fasik. So this is just a reminder, and, a, and I'm reminding myself and my brothers and sisters, to give precedence to your own sins first and foremost, if you have the ability, if you have the knowledge, if you have the azima, the determination, then yes, then, spit, then devote that some time for refuting the mistakes of Ahl Bida, wa Zandaka, wa Kufr, wa Shirk, wa Ilhad, and advising your brothers about their mistakes. But let's first advise ourselves. And we ask Allah the Almighty to accept our good and forgive our evil and have mercy upon the Salaf of this Ummah. And may Allah help the Muslims everywhere, protect the Muslims everywhere, preserve the Muslims everywhere, guide the Muslims everywhere, increase the Muslims everywhere with Khair. And may Allah subhanahu wa ta'ala especially assist our brothers and sisters in Burma and our brothers and sisters in Syria, those who it has been announced that they are asking for fat fatwa to eat human beings as it was announced in the masjid today here in Saudi Arabia. And may Allah subhanahu wa ta'ala help our brothers and sisters who are suffering from famine in Ethiopia. And may our brothers and sisters, may Allah subhanahu wa ta'ala help our brothers and sisters in the, the Democratic Republic of, uh, uh, of Central Africa and may Allah subhanahu wa ta'ala help our brothers and sisters in Pakistan and in India and wherever they may be suffering in Somalia and all over the world where they are filled with struggle and strife in Iraq, Afghanistan where they've been suffering from war and famine and instability for at least 10 years for where whole generations have been wiped out. And, at, and we ask Allah the Almighty to bless us with an increase in our na'mah and may he bless us to be of those who are thankful and those who share and give to our brothers and sisters. Wa sallallahu wa sallam ala Muhammad.